Very good, Mr. Chairman. All right, everybody, thank you for coming to this special meeting in the midst of your busy schedules. And we will begin with a uh, roll call by the town clerk, please. Chairman Reiniger? Here. Councilor Anderson? Here. Councilor Gabrielson? Here. Councilor Gillis? Councilor Harriman? Here. Councilor Jordan? Here. Councilor Thompson? Mr. Chairman, we do have a quorum. Thank you, Deborah. All right, we are here. Uh, now, my understanding is Councilors Gillis and Thompson may be participating. They're intending to participate remotely. They're not here yet. And uh, they will be participating in the executive session. So at any rate, uh, there is now an opportunity. Tim is calling. This is oh. Hi, Tim. <laughs> Tim. He says he's on. He just needs to be unmuted. Okay. He said, okay. All right. Gotcha. Okay. All right. Bye. Oh, thank you. All right. Opportunity for public comment limited to 15 minutes. Three minutes per person. Does anyone in the chamber like to comment? Anyone online like to comment? None online, Mr. Chairman. Okay, seeing none. Uh, I'm just going to, for the benefit of the public and the council, read an opening remark. Thank you all for making the effort to come together tonight for a special meeting. As you know, Matt Sturgis has submitted his resignation effective May 8, 2024. Therefore, I thought it would be prudent for us to meet as soon as possible to begin town council discussion of a manager search plan, a potential interim manager search plan, and an overall transition plan. We're going to need a number of meetings. Most will be public and a few will be necessary to hold an executive session pursuant to Maine statute. Fortunately, the 2016 town council's work on this same issue left us with both a template and, and a timeline. By unanimous vote in 2016, the town council won voted itself the search committee as a committee of the whole, and two, voted to utilize the services of a professional search consultant. I propose that we do the same at our next regular meeting on April 8, 2024. We can then move ahead quickly with items such as selecting an interim town manager, possibly crafting an uh, RFP for a search consultant, would advertise and vet applications for the town manager position, scheduling workshops, uh, citizen input, staff input, and executive sessions as needed, and more. The 2016 town council spent over four and a half months and, and held 17 meetings, which were either partly or exclusively related to the new manager search. Though Matt will be gone in just over a month, we should take our time in planning and executing our search. I'm going to ask Matt to meet with me as soon as possible to schedule several workshops on the calendar so that we can, can get we, going. Can, can we ask other Tim to mute? Oh, because what's happening is that what it is? Thank you. Because we can hear him, it's echoing through. Uh, oh, yes. Uh, oh, yes. Councilor Thompson, can you please mute your phone? It's a, uh, we can, thank you. Thanks. Can we start over? <laughs> <laughs> I, sorry, I had to say it. <laughs> All right, I'm almost done. Okay, paragraph. All right, <laughs> we'll, so we will, I will ask Matt to work with me to schedule 
to add, add some workshops to our busy schedules. I know it's budget season, but so that we can get going on this. While we, while we take our time in our search, Cape Elizabeth still needs a dedicated manager in the form of an interim manager. And this is one of several private personnel issues that I, I will present in executive session tonight for our discussion. And one last thing before we go into executive session. We need to plan a reception to recognize Matt's service to the town. Several of you have already shared some ideas about this. Is there a counselor who would be, who would like to organize a town council event or reception for Matt? I'd be happy to do that. Counselor Anderson, and I'm sure we'll all work with you in this yep. process. Uh, We'll help. We'll help. Okay. And, and Penny. Great. Thank you. It's kind of the farming season right now, and Matt. It's bad timing. I, I would have planned it all winter long. <laughs> and I know uh, Deborah Lane has graciously offered her assistance in, in some of the very important aspects of that. So. But you can't leave till after we have the party. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, then I'll plan it. Yeah. It'll take us a while. September. Yeah. That's what I was okay. Thinking, so how long I would need? August. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. All right. It works. Uh, so with that, uh, I would, let's see, we need a, a motion uh, to go into executive session. And can I ask a question? Sure. Pretty please. Um, do, and maybe we'll talk about that. And do, do we have like an ideal end date that we're shooting for, like July or something along those lines. Had you thought about that, of what what we might be looking for for a ideal hire date for the next town manager? I thought we would get consensus of the council on that for sure. Okay, yeah. okay. I, I, you know, I, I don't intend in any way to be uh, you know, uh, exercising any type of authority along those lines other than to administer the process. But so I definitely look to okay. council consensus on that timeline. Okay, cool. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Is there a, well, we, we do need a motion to go into executive session. Uh, it's ordered, the motion, the draft motion is ordered that the Cape Elizabeth Town Council enters into executive session pursuant to one main revised statute, section 4056A, to begin discussions of a, a new man, town manager search process. Is there a motion? So moved. Second. All right, Councilor Gableson is moved, second by Councilor Anderson. Further discussion, all in favor? Um, since we have hybrid, I believe we actually need to do a roll call oh, vote. That's right. Thank you. <laughs> All right, we'll call the roll, please. Okay. Councillor Anderson? Yes. Councillor Gabrielson? Yes. Councillor Harriman? No. Councillor Jordan? No. Councillor Thompson? Yes. Chairman Reiniger? Yes. Motion carries. Okay, thank you. All right, with that, we will go into the executive session in the Thomas Jordan room. Thank you. Hey, Matt, so I've got to get out of this one and go in to the other invite that you sent? Yes, sir. I, uh, I saw, now that I know that that's you, Tim, I saw you pop up there, so I'll, I'll, I'll beam you in immediately once we get in there. Okay, I'll get out of this one and get in the other one. Thanks. Thank you, sir. It is not anticipated that we will take any action after the executive session, so the viewers uh, need not stay. Nothing will happen, so thank you. 